it takes a lot of time of course you get like 100 gems per two gong hits but yeah if you have some time to spend hmm, you can do this I personally won't do this <laughs> because it's ridiculously stupid um Okay, cure poison yourself. I still have gold with me. A bit. <clears throat> so we will enter Builder Bar. Take a sip of the magic fountain and go to Ah, two levels. Oh, barely. Okay, my party is now a lot more powerful than ever before. Level 12 with 3 attacks per round, 4 attacks per round. Yes, they, they kill stuff now. Blue unholy key. I guess we can go into these locked areas. Alternatively, we can check out the next city. Maybe an interesting decision too. Huh. Okay. Accuracy better. One thousand gold. Yeah. The party has a good accuracy, except me. I kinda waggle my sword around in the air. <laughs> like a real man does! A red shield is fast by the dungeon door. Yes, you won't go there. Let's go to Swap Town. I guess that's the next logical step to go. Yes. 2,000 gold. Oh. Beyond the mountain range that lies to your east, the Moo cult is said to be at its strongest. The Moo Master guards his treasures fiercely. To your south is the northernmost tip of the land of the gargoyles, where those dark beasts constructed their new shrine when they were driven out by Thorn Blossom Orchard. Leaving B3. Leaving C3. On the island to the west lies the ruins of Castle Gravind, where Gravind the Illusionists once ruled over the western regions. To the east is the isle where Blackwind the Spellbinder built his fortress, which now sits empty and is said to be haunted by his ghost. Directly north is the Isle of Fire, where all manner of fiery fiends make their homes. Somewhere in the heart of the isle is a magically protected town, created as a home for the gods. Directly ahead are the swampy lands that surround Swamp Town. Many evil creatures lurk in the Evermores and Deathbog. Only experienced adventurers should stay, stray beyond the town walls. Entering Swamp Town. Good. We have a ninja can clan to fight here. Silverstein. The distant cries of adventurers long dead circulate around the benches of the vacant type house. Approach the apparition hovering behind the counter. Oh, yes. Rumors. Blistering Hades hosts a great deal of protective magic. Hey. Food. Food is a price. A mix of the few non-poisonous fruits and vegetables indigenous to the surrounding swamplands. A very tasty paste. 1,000 gold will fill your packs for 20 days. Okay, all than enough gold. Oops. Oh well. Village view training. Lion's quest in... Why are there ninjas in an aban abandoned city? Come on, kill them. 
do it. It's not the heart of magic. Magical. My mighty and magical. Err, uh, they are weakened. What? We got vitalize. I always thought ghouls to like disease you or something. <laughs> Ow. Ow. So, Moonshadow. Once a great chamber of ceremony, the breezy halls of Temple Moonshadow remain tended by the silent order of Yuresh, servants of Cosmonium. Ask the services? No. You won't need to yet. Oh, I need to check Covert's notes on the city. Why is this worker not doing any kind of huge damage against these things? Hm. Weapon is not broke. The shadow of doom looms over the once bustling corridors of Swamp Town. One Amash, master of the walking dead, came out of his tomb in Phantom Peaks and reduced the town to a graveyard, where ghosts and ghouls now bound to guard the burial mounds. The ninja clan remains undisturbed, as they had made an agreement with one Amash before he began his onslaught. Okay. Them before dying. I should have taken a sip of the fountain. <laughs> oh well. West. I kinda want to know the password for this town. All under the tomb of terror must be destroyed in order to discover its hidden secrets. Wait. Play the goods. Ow, shh. Ow. Um, fireball. Wow. That did a lot of damage. Turn on that. Good. Ghost. Uh, don't disturb the rest. I want to know the password for... Ah! Lo! This town be so entombed, its portal name was changed to doomed. <laughs> okay. Home. Hope. Yes, I need hope. Dangerous to west. Yes, it's it's not a smart idea to west in the water. Uh, yep. Good. Magical quickening overcome soon. I guess it's Highlander the quickening. I can have happy about that. Uh, great. It's already dark. <laughs> well, perhaps we can kill some ghouls. Doomed. Yes, 20 levels more and they are kinda easy. <laughs> uh, no! <sighs> Don't load! I want to save. Wait. Ah, 
As soon as I get Lloyd's beacon for big, I'm going to set the beacon to the party. It should make things a lot easier. Turn on that. <clears throat> oh! I really hate these boots. Okay, I will clean out Swamp Town's upper and lower region. What time is it? Okay, now. Lights beacon. There. Return. Good. Very good. We have a longer duration on this. It could die a bit faster. They don't weaken me. It's kind of nice. The statue of Yet, Kufa, Kof, Kufa, yes, Kofon of Swampton. What turns everything around but does not move? Yes. Incorrect. What turns. Oh, yes. A mirror. Use the password primary to enter the main sector. Primary. Yes, the earth doesn't move. Uh, dig it up, yes. Nothing in the grave. Nothing in the grave. Ancient jewelry. Great. It's easy to lose your way in the maze from hell. Holy bonus! Nice. Oh, man, holy bonus. One of the gems. Curse you all for defiling my resting place. Oh, okay. 5,000 gold. Yes, whatever. I won't go to the. But the dead bed. Yes. What goes up and down but never moves? Yes. Use the password sub level. Sub level. And the beta engine sector. Yes, you all. It's lots of guilt. I don't really do damage to this thing. Woo! Woo! Eat my fireball! No. Funerary grounds. Oh! I'm, I'm dead. How did that happen? I guess I was too cursed. <laughs> yes. And curse here. Ooh! Ooh! Oops! Um. Uh. Load. <laughs> Don't fight ghosts in this game. What the fuck happened there? Uh, now I have to do this all over again. I wasn't expecting to die so horribly. Yes, I guess it's easier to... The problem is I have to examine these graves because one of these contains the guy who sells me uh, the... Uh, uh, guilt thingy. When Princess Trueberry was abducted by Shelton the Dark, Prince Smallberry was the first to come to her aid and the first to fall dead at the Dark One's feet. Louis Light. Ancient Artifact of Evil. Ooh. Ancient Jewelry. 